Hey there, hair companions, beauties. This is T. Williams with TNS Hair Co. Wanted to go over a review with you. This is part two. Part two. If you saw part one, it was of this beauty here. But she was big, fluffed out. Big hair, big hair. And it is of the Equal Cuban Twist Braidable Weaving Hair. And as you can see, she gets pretty big and fluffy. Now, I have curled her. What do you think? What do you think? I absolutely love it. Let me give you. Do you see? I'm trying to wink. I don't know how to wink. Anyway, I do. I really do like this hair. Uh, I don't know if you all had an opportunity to see my other video, which is of the make sure I have this straight um which was of the same one but I called her big red it's of this same type of hair which is the Cuban twist hair but it was crochet it was bulk hair so I made a crochet unit out of her I cut her into a short bob here made her very similar to this nice and fluffy this hair is fluffy it looks like a lot of hair and like you would think that it would be heavy absolutely not it is light weight that's the one good thing I love about it the other good thing I love about it my curls I love the way it holds curls and the hair looks so similar to my own hair just that I mean of course it's colored but the texture looks very similar to mine it is of a coarse texture but like I said it's very lightweight hair um what I did was I did this as a quick weave and that's because I wanted to be able to show you the unit soon as I made her, I wanted to, well, basically, I did it pretty quick because I wanted you to see her. Um, so that's why I quick weaved her. I had her blown out, and when I say blown out, meaning that I basically just pulled the hair apart. Pulled the hair apart. This hair is on tracks. That's the beauty of this hair, y'all. It is on tracks. This braidable weaving hair is exactly what it is weaving hair which means you can sew it onto your hair you can sew it onto your weaving cap your dome cap whatever you use convenient you can sew it a lot of people want to make crochet units they want to use this hair but some people just don't have the patience to do it so this was an awesome awesome idea I mean it really was I think it makes it very convenient for a lot of people who want to be able to get this done and get it done quickly here you go what I did with that hair I fluffed it out and I fluffed it so that way I could curl her. I used the cold wave rods on this hair. Um, and that's basically the, the ones that look like perm rods. But I used the orange and cream ones. And I also used some pink ones. So like a pinkish purple color. Even Anyway, that's what I use. I use cold wave rods. What I will do differently, because this time I made the unit first and then I dipped the hair. Next time, I'm going to pre-dip the hair, which means I'm going to ride the hair just like it is on these tracks, and then I'm going to dip it into hot water, boiling hot water. Then once it's done, I can just unravel it, and then I can basically put it onto my cap. I don't regret doing it this way, but I think my curls would have been even tighter had I pre-dipped it, but I still like the way these curls fall. I mean, I love the way the curls fall, and I want you to be able to see it absolutely love it but I, I'll definitely give this a thumbs up all the way because the hair is nice and fluffy the hair is very similar to my texture it is a coarse texture however it looks very similar to my hair the holes curls the bomb I mean I cannot complain about this hair I'm not gonna complain about it because I do like it um only one thing I will say is it's soft but it could be even softer. But it's still soft. I mean, it, to me anyway. Um, but like I said, it serves its purpose. I'm still... I'm still going to have you looking fabulous regardless. At least I hope so. I hope you think I do. I hope you like it. Do you like it? I do. I love it. Anyway. This will 
if it's not already it will be and I believe it it may be in your local beauty supply stores um just like the other one this is what I was using for my crochet braids which as you can see it's the double strand double strand hair this is braidable weaving hair so there is a difference so when you go to the store there's two different ones this is on tracks so if you see weaving you know that it's on tracks if you see it like this it's bulk hair which means that it's bulk hair um, you can actually make a crochet unit out of it you can actually use it for braids so just remember that is the difference weave when you see weaving hair that means it's on tracks so again next time when I do this I'm gonna pre rod and dip the hair put it on this baby and make her and go so I'm gonna give you a side view and back view as I turn as I turn y'all know I'm goofy but anyway I wanted to go over this with you thank you so much shake and go for giving me the opportunity to review this hair I do I absolutely love it and I love the fact that I can also use tracks instead of just using bulk hair so check it out hope you guys like it thanks for tuning in i have pictures on my facebook page under tns hair co custom wigs i also have pictures on my instagram at t love all day and here youtube under tns hair co custom wigs thank you so much for tuning in and i hope you all have a blessed blessed day take care